Well, that ferry that was pulled from service was the Bremerton Ferry, so they pulled one over from Bainbridge, one of the two servicing that island. Therefore, those two popular routes just had one ferry each between the regular rush hour traffic, the commuter traffic, the tourists and the Mariners game. It led to a very busy night. Construction worker Robert Pesce is making the best of an inconvenient situation. You either come out of pocket or just wait your turn. I mean, that's why I bring my strength. Yeah, I don't mind getting stuck too much. Passengers left waiting Friday. Some drivers for as many as three hours as the popular Seattle to Bainbridge route was reduced to just one boat down from two. I, mean, I do have options. I could take the fast boat, but my company pays for it. <laughs> the big boat. That boat was docked pulled out of service. Washington State Ferry says it's narrowing in on a propeller that may be damaged. For passengers, an all too familiar game of hurry up and wait. It's hard to plan ahead. I've been one time like coming back from college and I was waiting for the ferry and it took me probably like three hours to get on the ferry. You don't really know until you get to the terminal and it's kind of like, oh, you're delayed 30, 45 minutes. And it's like, okay, well, I'm stuck here waiting. 30, 45 minutes. Luggage, large items, children. The state's ferry system is the largest fleet of its kind in the country, 21 ships, and most have logged many miles. Back in April, the Walla Walla, the same ship, went aground near Bainbridge Island after a generator failed on the boat. The vessel, more than 50 years old. It's inconvenient. I mean, on a Friday, you know, you after a long day, you just want to go home. But As workers tend to the damaged ferry, the ones that are still seaworthy are working to shuttle a growing crowd of passengers. Monday, regular ferry commuters, ferry riders will have a chance to voice their concerns. They have a venue. The uh, Bashan Island High School uh, is hosting a talk by uh, the, the Vashon Chamber put on. Uh, it's a chance to kind of put a plan together that they'll ultimately propose to the governor's office for changes that they say are now of impacting their life. Many, uh, a handful of politicians are scheduled to attend. In Seattle, Spashan Robertson, King 5 News.